open up, up. open up, shutting down like a back top. Open up, open up, open up, open up. Good morning, Mustangs. I'm Andrew Klepser. And I'm Jada Thrash. Coming at you with your announcements for October 21st. Hey Mustangs, let's see what's happening in school this week. Riley, take it away. Hi guys, it's Riley with your school news. This week the food drive is still going on. Help teens in your community who are in need of food by donating things to your third hour class. Your items will be rated on a scale of tastiness, so make sure you bring in your favorite snacks. Meals such as mac and cheese, hearty soups and rice will be three points. Snacks such as popcorn and fruit cups will be two points and canned foods will be one point. The third hour with the most points at the end will win a donut party, so make sure you turn in your items before October 25th. Also, make sure you sign up for your AP and IP test this week. Registration will be open until October 31st. AP tests are $94, IB tests are $119, and all fees are non-refundable. To sign up, go to portedcentralexams.com, and if you have any questions, you can contact Mr. Lancaster at elancaster at portageps.org. Make sure you don't miss the deadline and clear your calendars for the test date because there will be no rescheduling. Do your parents need to talk to your teachers? Well, the wait is almost over. Conferences will be the 4th and 6th of November starting at 3.30 p.m. Teachers will be in their classrooms until 7.15, so make sure you stop by. Also look forward to play previews, which will be Wednesday this week, and keep your grades up because November 1st is the end of the first quarter. I'm Riley Cahill, and that was your school news for October 21st to October 25th. Now back to you, Jada and Andrew. Thanks, Riley, and don't forget to bring in some yummy food to help the teens in our community. Now let's switch over to comedy. On to you, Kate. Hey Mustangs, it's Kate Lindsay, and this week we are going to be playing Will You Do It? Testing how comfortable couples, siblings, best friends, and exes are with each other. Each pair will be asked a series of seven questions ranging from will you switch socks to will you share gum. If you are a germaphobe, you might just want to look away. Let's get started and see how they respond to this. <laughs> Yuck, but it does look like all of our pairs were pretty comfortable. Great job, guys. Back to you, Andrew. Now let's see what's happening in Mustang activities this week. Hey Mustangs, I'm Parker Mason, and I'm here to fill you in on all of the activities happening this week at Ported Central. The award-winning Ported Central Marching Men had their final competition this past week in the East Kentwood, where they hope to go undefeated for the fourth year in a row. Congratulations, Mustangs, on achieving that goal. Mamma Mia, here we go again. Have you heard the news? Ported Central Theater will be presenting the musical smash hit phenomenon, Mamma Mia. If you are interested in auditioning, you should plan to attend the audition workshops on October 28th and 29th, where the directors will be teaching you the music and choreography for auditions. No experience is necessary. Hey ladies, Powder Puff is just around the corner, so if you're interested in playing, head down to the Welcome Center to sign up. Also, we still need five more boy cheerleaders to cheer these ladies on. Not interested in playing? No problem. Join the superfans in the stands on October 28th at 5 p.m. And finally, we have the opening of our fall play, Moon Over Buffalo. This hilarious play will leave you smiling ear to ear and tickle your funny bone. You can catch this show from October 25th to November 3rd, with a special student night performance on October 30th. Get tickets at pchsperformingarts.org. Hey Mustangs! Let's take a look to see what's happening in athletics this week. On to you, Carter. On Thursday, your men's varsity water polo faced East Kentwood in the PCHS Natatorium. 
Despite their best efforts, your varsity football team faced a tough loss against Madawan last Friday. We were so happy to see so much support and pink in the stands in honor of Breast Cancer Awareness Month. We are so happy to be Mustangs regardless of if we win or lose. Thank you, Carter. And make sure you check out the football game this Friday at 5.30 p.m. at Niles High School. It might be a drive, but come on out to support. Back to you, Jada and Andrew. And now on to Eileen for the Mario Kart craze that's taking over the Mustang way. In three, two, one. On September 25th, 2019, the long-awaited Mario Kart game was released on the App Store, and students at Porta Central have been raving about the game. Is it the fiery competition of the race, or the childhood nostalgia of our favorite Wii game that is drawing players? I sat down with gamer Reese Knight to get his opinion. Why did you start racing? Um, because I played Mario Kart as a kid on the Wii, and when they made a mobile game, I didn't see why not. What is your favorite course on the new app? Um, Rainbow Road. And what is your favorite power-up? Um, Pauline's like special power-up where it gets you seven of all of them. <laughs> busy time of the year with the end of the first quarter coming soon but be sure to make time in your schedule to check everything out from all of us here at pctv we hope you have a radical week mustangs this is jada thrash and andrew klepser signing, signing off, off. Oh. Open up.